The original bunk beds that come with the Scamp are not satisfactory to me. What I believe is that in the 70s, this is a theory, when the Scamps were created, I believe that people were a little less dense maybe than now. We in our household, we make corn-fed Midwesterners, so we're sturdy. Uh, so this is what originally came with this. These are little tiny hinges. And then I think this is like wood that's attached to the fiberglass. And then these little, the little poles that hook into these screws. And then the poles just sit here. So to me, it was not sturdy enough. Baby. <laughs> oh. oh, that is beautiful. <laughs> it is cozy. That's nice. <laughs> Watch it collapse. <laughs> the feet just go straight through yeah. the fiberglass. Uh. I don't mind this. I can sleep up here. <laughs> it's a little it's a little tight for me. Going that way, you're gonna <laughs> crop it again. Go the other way. <laughs> Is it less coffin like now with that pole moved? Yeah, it's not bad. I mean, it's still for me, it's just the distance, yeah, between my chest and the thing. There's nothing that's gonna end that. Okay, let me try. <sighs> this does not bother me in the least. This is a personal space dream. It's a dream. No one can touch me or bug me. It doesn't feel claustrophobic to me. That left the room. Turn over. <laughs> Turn over. If you had like a sleeping bag in there, it'd be a little bit constricting. Yeah, maybe. But look, I can put my knees up even. Yeah. Okay. Good job. Okay, how do you feel? Good. That was a lot of work. <laughs> okay, so what is this? Aluminum called. This is 8020 extruded aluminum with brackets. You have the, you have to get these like special brackets and little fittings that slide into the channels and then you tighten it down. It's rated for way higher than what we're ever going to use it for. So now probably a 300 pound person could sleep up here comfortably. E easily, easily. And yep. we put foam noodles on all the sharp parts and he's going to zip tie them down. Mm -hmm. And now we do not have to sleep with the toddler because <laughs> no one will fall out of bed now. Yep. The little one can sleep up here and the littler one can sleep down there. <laughs> the 
fridge is stocked. We didn't prep as well this time. It's probably gonna be a nightmare, but under here, we have the table and the toilet. Bunk beds are done. Let's get out of here. We're getting better. Most of it's just food. Bunk beds. Pajamas laid out. Those are some awesome bunk beds! <laughs>